In this video, I'm going to give you my top reasons to root your Android device. And, oh, low battery, okay, thanks. Um, to root your Android device, it varies from device to device, so I won't be teaching you how to do that. You're going to have to do a bit of research on your own. Um, so what I'm going to do is demonstrate and explain why I think you should root your Android device. Um, the first step is going to take a couple of minutes, but believe me, it's it's worth the wait. I'm going to show you why it puts iOS to, and BlackBerry to shame. Um, so what I'm going to do is show you my favorite Android app that requires root. It's called Titanium Backup. And for this example, we're going to use this app right here, Abduction World Attack. Ignore Abduction 2. Just ignore that. So like I said, it's going to take a couple of minutes to show you this step, but believe me, it's well worth it. So the reason I'm opening this up is because I want to show you my score. So this is the final level. And remember this number, 16,327. So what I'm going to do is go to Titanium Backup. And I'm going to actually make a backup of the app, Abduction World Attack. So I'm going to do is select it, make a backup, then do my Android settings, select abduction, uninstall it, okay, it's uninstalled, and if you need more proof, as you can see, there's abduction 2, but not abduction world attack, so what we're going to do now is restore it, I'm going to show you just how good it is at doing that, okay, this time I'm going to select restore, restore missing apps with data, because what it does is it, it backs it up to the um, SD card when it makes a backup. So what I'm doing now is restoring it. Okay, there's Abduction World Attack in the apps list, but that's not good enough. What I want to do is show you just how good of a backup it makes. Go to the game, adventure, and there, the last level. Score 16,327. That's how good this app is, Titanium Backup. It makes an exact backup of any app you select off the list. And what I actually did is I used to have the Nexus 1. And when I was switching over to this phone, which is the Infuse 4G, um, I made a backup of all my apps and scores, including Abduction, and restored it on this phone, the Infuse 4G. And it restored all my apps with all the settings. If I was a game, it would store the score, everything exactly the same. So I highly suggest you root your um, Android device just for that one reason alone. Another neat feature about Titanium Backup is that from the app list here, you can actually freeze. So, so put a pause on any app or uninstall it. I'm on the Rogers network and my phone came with a whole bunch of Rogers bloatware and their, their own apps, which I didn't want. This list here, if you tap on one, I'll show you. See it says uninstall? You can uninstall any app in this list, including bloatware from your um, mobile operator. So that's what I did with the Rogers apps. I didn't want them, so I got rid of them. Easy as that. Uh, another cool app is Root Explorer, which allows you to explore any directory and folder within your Android device. Not just the SD card, but I mean the actual phone itself. And my phone shipped with the Rogers network, and this Infuse 4G is capable of recording at 30 frames per second, but when it came out of the box, it's only capable of recording 15 frames per second. And the people over at XDA had a fix for it. All I had to do is copy and paste a few files from my computer into a very certain, like, special directory within the phone pasted it and I got full 30 frames per second recording so you can actually use uh, root to even like modify and upgrade your device um, another cool feature where is it ROM toolbox it has a whole bunch of other stuff but I'm showing you how you can customize the processor speed this app along with set CPU uh, I'm gonna list all the apps in the description the, the ones that I'm mentioning um, you can set the CPU speed CPU speed, sorry, to whatever you want. Um, set CPU has a bit more functions so that whenever the screen is off, you can have it so that your processor speed will go to the minimum. So overnight, your processor speed, say when you're sleeping, your screen is off overnight, your processor speed will only be running at the minimum speed. As soon as you turn the screen on, 
the processor speed will kick in and work at the speed it's supposed to. Um, another feature here, where the heck did you go? Is permissions. I believe uh, the developer has updated this app so that this has become uh, a free version and there's actually a, no, a now a pro version with more features which you have to pay for. Essentially what this app does is allow you to block permissions from apps. That's right, you can block permissions. So say for example, my Rogers uh, network, they give me an app, my account, which allows me to monitor my mobile data usage so I don't go over and etc. But they want a permission to write SMS, read my contacts and stuff. And I mean, yeah, it's a billion dollar company. I mean, why would they want to be honest, right? Whoever heard of a mobile carrier being honest and caring about its customers? So what I wanted to do was disable certain permissions. So for this example, you you can actually turn permissions on or off depending on what you set them to. So right now, it's active. I want to deactivate write SMS. Tap it. It's changing the permission. When you reboot the device and turn it back on, that permission will be set to disabled now. That's how easy it is. Um, you can flash custom ROMs, which is made by developers, that tend to be a huge upgrade in compared to what manufacturers give you, which is ROM Manager right here. ROM Manager also installs Clockwork Mod Recovery, in which if you restart your phone in recovery mode, you can make an exact duplicate backup of your entire phone, even better than Titanium Backup. And the reason I'm speaking so quickly is because it, these are just my top reasons and my top apps to um, root your device. There are just way too many more to list. Um, I could keep going on and on, but uh, those are my top apps. So, with that said, uh, I would like to explain a lot more about rooting, but I can't. So, if you found this video useful, subscribe to my channel. For technology news and rumors, check out my website, and thanks for watching.